I had someone comment on uh, one of my videos and asking how I <clears throat> how I got my chickens to go in the coop at night. She, uh, I believe it was a she, said that um, you know if she waited till after dark, she had to go out there at dark, and she was kind of fearful. So uh, I told her what I do, and I will show you that now. It is uh, five o'clock. It's going to be they'll they'll be going home anyway in about uh, thirty minutes or so, but um, I want them to go home now. If I'm ready to go in the house now, I want them to go on to get in the chicken coop now. Now I'm fixing to redo that chicken coop. But that's a whole nother video. Um, so right now they're out here. Of course they're out here watching me because they know I got something for them. But what I told her and what I will tell you now is that whatever you whatever you have that they really like. Uh, <clears throat> in other words, I'm feeding, I'm trying to shift some feed around in my hands here. Uh, I feed laying mash or lay pellets, either one, free choice all day long, all they want. But I don't give them uh, free choice, I don't give them scratch or corn. So at night I go fill up their thing uh, with the lay mash and then I'll give them the scratch. Uh, or sometimes corn, whatever, cracked corn. And that's how I get them in the pen when I want them to go to bed. Just like your kids. When you want them to go to bed, you want them to go to bed, right? Well, here's how I get them to go to bed. I come inside their coop. Yeah, I've got quite a few eggs here. I got 10 yesterday out of 11 hens. Wow, that was good. Okay, what I do is come in here and inside their pen, I give them the scratch grain that they love. And they all stand outside, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, how do I get in there? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I love this stuff. I know I like that stuff. How do I get in there? And they'll make their way in here while I'm getting the eggs, while I'm feeding the uh, mash in their hanging feeder, which is here. While I'm doing this, all of them will come in here. Still got one straggler. She'll be in here in a minute. And then I count them. Count them coming in, count them going out in the morning, in the evening. And I lost one, and I'll show you what I have done to overcome that. But I lost one of them. Let me count here. Nine, 10, 11. That's what I got. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. And the rooster. So, um, so I count them. And then I close the door uh, on them at night. I wasn't doing that, and that's why I lost one to a predator, probably a possum. Probably not the same one that did it before because he's no longer with us. But he had enough of our cousin or something. Anyway, I'll just close the door behind me. This way, uh, whether it's 4 o'clock in the afternoon and I have to go somewhere and, I, you know, I don't want them to... Uh, uh, I don't have to come out here at dark when I get home from somewhere, wherever that is. Anyway, when I want them to go to bed, I want them to go to bed. And I say, kiddos, let's go to bed. And I say it with something they like. Something you don't give them all the time. If they love corn, give them corn, crack corn. And just enough to get them in the pen. If it's scratch, give them scratch. Bread, chickens love bread. That works real well too. Just throw some bread in here. Problem, only problem with bread is one of them will grab it and take off running and she may run outside the pen. So this is better. You put it on the ground, they have to scratch around and get it, peck it here. Like I say, bread, <laughs> bread's like kind of like throwing them a cricket. Throw them a cricket and they're gonna run around playing handoff for a while because somebody's gonna steal it. She's gonna run out, she gonna squall and say, I've got a cricket. The other one's gonna come over and snatch it out of her mouth and say, I got a cricket. And the other one, it's funny. I'd show that to you sometime. Anyway, they're all in. Door's closed. I'm inside. Door will be open when I get out. But, I mean, I'm going to close the door on the way out. But I got to get the eggs. And this is how I do it. Uh, just when you want them in, bring them in with something they love. Count them. Make sure you got them all in before you close the door. All right. Like I say, I lost one. I had 12. I got 11 now. 
and I'll show you real quick, maybe next two or three days, have what I have done to remedy that. One of the things is I'm locking them up at night. I was not doing that. Uh, but I did something else even more dastardly. <laughs> All right. How to put your chickens to bed when you want them to go to bed. This is it. Here we go. That means we're gone. And chicken. <laughs>